Hey Pisces, I hope you're doing well. Uh, this is going to be a general reading for your next surprise. Any information you need, you can find it down below in the description box. Pisces. What do we have for Pisces in our next surprise? This is for Pisces. All placements, by the way. <clears throat> Pisces, I do have personals open right now. Uh, due to the holidays coming up and then the birth of my baby, um, these will only be open for a limited time. My email is down below if you want to chat with me about the details. Uh, Pisces, let's see what we have here. Ooh, the lovers. There could definitely be a new connection here for some of you. Or there's a big decision that you're making. We're going to be clarifying a little bit. Um, you have the Emperor showing up next. Okay, so two majors showing up here. I feel like there is a big focus on the self, and because of this, I feel like some new love comes in with the lovers showing up. For those of you who are single, for others of you, I feel like this could just be a bond strengthening. My goodness, the hair font. We got Taurus energy. This is somebody you have a strong spiritual connection to. For those of you who are um, in a relationship, I feel like this could be the relationship moving to the next level. The hair font is a higher level of commitment. This could be living together. This could be, you know, making things official, being exclusive. This could be uh, engaging, um, getting engaged. <laughs> this could be getting engaged. Um, it could be getting married, you know. Um, but three majors, uh, there's definitely a turning point for you guys. I also feel like it starts with a turning point when it comes to the way you see yourself. I feel like the way you're viewing yourself is changing, okay? The five of wands. Yeah, there's definitely been an internal battle here, but I feel like you're coming out of that. Like you're coming into the light here, Pisces. Something really positive is about to happen for you. You have the five of wands right here. Like it's been a really troublesome time. Maybe the last five or six months with this energy showing up here, it's been a really tough time recovering from something or, you know, it's like the way you thought of so many different things has changed. Like your worldview, your view about love, your view towards yourself, business, whatever the case may be, work. Um, you know, I feel like a lot of that has changed. A lot of your views have changed. You know, um, people who knew you like six months ago probably don't even know you anymore. <laughs> probably know nothing about you except your name, Pisces. Is honestly the energy that I feel here. You have the Prince of Wands showing up. I do think there's some kind of communication coming in. It could be in love. Um, some of you between the third, yeah, okay, between the 23rd and the 25th. Yeah, I'm getting the 23rd here. There's something big that's going to happen on the 23rd for a lot of you. Um, it's been kind of waiting. It's been brewing. It's been. You know, there, there's something here that has been like cooking up for you that I feel is going to be, um, you know, coming to some kind of completion on the 23rd. There's even a unicorn here in this card, a unicorn and a lion. I feel like this is something that hits you very quickly. Um, with the unicorn showing up, it's, it's something different, okay? It's something that you may not expect or it's something that you may just feel is like magical. Ooh, the chariot. Some of you, you may receive some news about a move that you've been trying to make, or there's some kind of victory here. Like, there's something you've been trying to accomplish. You finally accomplished this, okay? So, uh, this could be, like, maybe you've been waiting to hear back about, like, passing a test. Maybe you're wanting to know, did I pass it? I fell. Maybe you're wanting to know, like, mm, is this place still available for me to look at? Uh, maybe you're wanting to hear back about an interview or something or some of you I get that you may want to collaborate with a person here like you may want to team up with them uh, Pisces so I feel like you could be hearing back about this um, you have the Queen of Cups here and you have the Knight of Cups here. I also feel like there are multiple options in love coming in for you, Pisces. Maybe multiple water sign. Um, I got Cancer and Pisces showing up here with both of these cards. But I really feel with that Queen of Cups energy, you're learning to trust your intuition a lot more when it comes to these new chapters. Maybe there are people in your life who are like, you know, naysayers, doubters, things of that nature. You're learning how to shut those energies out. I feel like you're also shutting out people who are not so caring, you know. Um, and I'm a Pisces myself and I've actually already been doing this. But you could be surprising yourself at how many people you're kind of like shutting out of your life. Like I was going through a really hard time between, um, you know, like December and April. And there was one person who was there for me. You know, I, there were people I could talk to. But this person, th there was one person who actually checked on me. Who made it a point to be like, you know, I don't feel like you're actually okay. What can I do for you? You know, things like that. I had one person who did that. Okay. One person. And, uh, you know, that really opened my eyes during that time and a, a little while after. So, um, yeah, I started cutting certain energies out. I feel like you could be doing the same thing here, okay? You could be going through um, that type of transition here where you're realizing, okay, I'm investing a lot here and these people are not. So, um, yeah, I feel like some of you, you could just be letting go of certain energies and I feel like you're welcoming in new ones as you do this here. There are definitely more, um, 
you know, tender people coming towards you is how I feel um, with the Knight of Cups energy. Like these are people who are very nurturing, very caring. I feel like they also have a vision for how they want things to go. And not only do they have a vision, but they're not afraid to speak on it, okay? Maybe you express your feelings and it's like, whoa, did this person just express their feelings back, you know? Um, I feel like something like that could be going on. It's just not what you're used to. It's not what you're used to. And I feel like it's going to lead to something really positive, especially for those of you where that's like a love connection because that hair font, um, it definitely is a really positive card for love and something stable and long lasting. Um, and loyal, not to mention loyal. Pisces, um, I do read over on TikTok, Instagram, and Patreon. I also have another channel. Don't forget that my email is down below for any of you who want to chat with me about personals if you're interested. Uh, everything's down there, okay? Uh, but if this is where we part, Pisces, thank you for watching this far. I really appreciate you, and I hope I'll see you next time. Bye.